This all really matters. Um, each state becomes a laboratory of liberty. Um, you see that today. There are states, for example, that tax high, have um, you know burdensome regulations, and what do you see? They have high employment rates. They have jobs that exit in the state. That's a little laboratory of liberty because somebody said, "I have an experiment to run. I want to see. I think government can spend money better than the people can. So I'm going to take more from them, and we're going to do really good stuff with it, and we're going to make sure they have less to do with it, and uh, we're going to run businesses because we don't think they really know what they're doing anyhow. We can do it better. And then we tried that, and it's not working very well. It hasn't worked well in California. It hasn't worked well in Michigan. It's not working very well in a lot of states. You have other states that are increasing their jobs. And they're getting magnets for jobs. And why? Because they also conducted a, an alternative experiment. And their experiment was, we think people can spend their money better than they can. We think that, generally speaking, businesses can make better decisions about how to run the business than we can. And that seems to be working. And I think that's you know, a useful exercise. And hopefully the states that tried the dumb experiment will stop trying and realize that their experiment works better. The other thing it does, of course, it keeps authority closer to home. It's a good idea from a management perspective, just step aside from government. It's a good idea to, from a managerial perspective to put the decision-making power as close to the, the person or people that will have to live with the decisions, that have the most input, that have the most impact. It doesn't make a lot of sense to, I mean, we do this all the time, for example. Um, they would like to be able to drill for oil in places in Alaska. Why can't they? Because people in Boston don't want them to. Okay. People in Boston have never been to Alaska, never intended to go to Alaska, but they don't want them to, so they won't. And, and you know, that's, that's a screwy way of running things. Um, and yet that's kind of what um, we do now. Of course, state sovereignty also quite substantial critics against a tyrant or tyrannical majority grabbing power.